Okay, I would like to welcome and thank you for, um, I thank you, what? <laughs> <laughs> Never mind, let's start over. Okay, I would like to welcome everybody. I would like to thank Harris Crab House for hosting this. I would also like to thank our hosting the September Mixer and Teacher of the Year and the new teacher celebration. We would also like to thank U.S. Mortgage. Where's Tony? Thank you so much, Tony. And Rocco. I would also like to thank Atlantic Title Group for sponsoring the bar. Both of them are sponsoring the bar. You guys, that really means a lot. Thank you so much for doing that. Would you like to come up and just say a couple things really quick? I think it would be important. Why do you always ask me to talk or anything? Because. You're cute. I probably don't need a microphone. No, I just, you know, I'm just glad that we were invited to come just as well because it's, we're fortunate to be in a community that we have. I mean, I've had three children go through the school system. And second to none, this is probably the greatest community to be in. Queen Anne's County has exceptional ratings. We know that. But it's a dedication to all you guys. And for the achievement that you just got awarded, it's an amazing thing around. I congratulate you because your peers are awesome. So that's what I say, U.S. Mortgage. Congratulations the community does. We think we're a part of it. Ryan, yes, you did a good job. Ryan, I know you don't like doing this, Ryan. Ryan, come up here and introduce yourself. <laughs> I'm Ryan with the Atlantic Tower Group, and uh, yeah, it's our pleasure to sponsor the bar. I have three kids that are getting ready to go through the school system, so I actually have one that's in it right now. So everything teachers do, good send the kid out for everything that you do. So. Uh, Ryan Lennox on the roof and Joy. Great. <laughs> okay, very good. Now, for the people that don't know me, I'm your chair for the Chamber of Commerce this year. My name is Eva DeJovan Stoops. I have Chesapeake Environmental Lab for 27 years. I am a product of Queen Anne's County Public School System. I'm extremely proud of that. And all of our daughters are also products of our school system, along with my husband, Bill Stoops. Now, before we start, I just have some really quick chamber news that we need to get through, okay? So sit tight. Um, first thing is, uh, we have our upcoming sporting clay tournament, which is October 19th. We need some shooters, and we need some sponsors. This is a great, great opportunity for you to do team building and some great networking. It's going to be held at Pint or the point at Pintail. I have uh, tickets to buy. It's three for $20. You get a chance to win two um, guns. And uh, I don't think my husband wants me to buy any, but we won't even go there. But if anybody would like to buy some chances, please get a hold of me or anybody else. I have them. The other thing I want to bring to your attention is light up the narrows okay this is a um voting extravaganza it is going to be held on october 27th uh it's going to start at wells cove and it's going to end at mirrors point and the awards are going to be here at harris's this is just a fun community event that's all it is so if you have a boat decorate it because you have a chance to win cash prizes so it's going to be a lot of fun. Just go to the Chamber website and everything is downloaded right there for you. My last little thing is Bars and Bears. Bars is Bay Area Association of Realtors and Bears is Adopt-A-Bear. As you know, we do have a need for that in the community. So the Bay Area Association of Realtors have been doing this event. This is our third year and I'm gonna tell you you want to talk about fun, hands down, the best event of the year. It's a lot of fun. We have about 20 different food vendors, about 15 different gift baskets to raffle on. Each basket is probably about $200 easily. It is going to be a blast. It is September 29th, so we only have about 30 tickets left. That's it, 30 tickets left. So if you're interested, please go online and grab your tickets, okay? Now, let's go ahead and elect the officials. Uh, <laughs> yeah. 
Let's introduce our elect officials. Or we can take a vote right now. All in favor say aye. Okay. You ready? When you uh, are, are you all around me? Jim, you're not here. Please move up. Jack, come on up. Commissioner Jim Moran, raise your hand. Say hello. Thank you. Our Commissioner Jack Wilson, wonderful. Senator Steve Hershey, if you didn't fall overboard, there you go. Delegate Jay Jacobs, thank you so much. We have Mike Arns, the County Liaison for Congressman Harris, thank you. We have the wonderful Delegate Steve Arns. And we have Mary Tobin, who is Maryland Association of Realtors incoming president, wonderful. All right, so you guys stay close. Time out. What am I doing? We have Dr. Kane. We're getting there. I'm there. I've got this. Okay. All right, are you ready? Okay, so we have new teachers. If you're a new teacher, can you please wave your hand? Bring it to the side. so much. I just want you to know you're probably in the single best school system in the whole state of Maryland. Just saying. This is also a special mixer. This is where we recognize not only our new teachers, but our Queen Anne's County Teacher of the Year. This is by far one of my favorite mixers. I can't even begin to tell you. Oh my goodness. Tonight we are happy to celebrate our new educators in Queen Anne's County, and we would also like to congratulate Queen Anne's County Teacher of the Year, Rhonda Moore. <laughs> Rhonda teaches first grade at Mattapique Elementary School at this time. I would like to have her come forward. So you can come stand right here, right next to me. I promise not to embarrass you. Okay, and if I could um, ask uh, Steve, our Senator Steve Hershey, if we're going to go this way first, or you want to do Dr. Kane? Dr. Kane first. Dr. Kane, please step forward. Dr. Kane is our superintendent for Queen Anne's County. She's doing a great job. Let's give her a huge round of applause. Good evening. I am so happy to be here. It's such an awesome occasion. Before I say anything further, I just would like to thank several people because it's going to get off my mind. So first of all, I'd like to thank our commissioners who are here this evening. Thank you so much for your support, especially for our new teachers, our teacher of the year. Thank you. Also, we have our elected officials. We've got Steve Ayers. We've got Mr. Jacobs and Mr. Bruce. Everybody here has been so supportive of our, uh, our teachers and our school district in general. We recognize that this is all about community, and it's so important that we have your support, and we feel safe in knowing that we do. So I'd like to thank you for that. I can't not thank uh, Linda Friday and the Chamber. Please give them a round. and all of our business partners who are here this evening. We could not do what we do if it was not for your support. So please know from the bottom of my heart that we thank you for that. Uh, just one quick word. We have so many opportunities for our students to get out into the community and to support your businesses, but also opportunities for our students to get out into your businesses and learn your businesses. So whether it be through an internship or work-based learning, we're interested in having our students learn from you. So that's gonna be integral to their giving back to this community in Queen Anne's County. So please, we'll be coming to you and, and we thank you. We're gonna have a tour, a CTE tour, so we're gonna be inviting you for that. We just want you to know that we feel your support and we're most grateful for it. So. The occasion, our new teachers and Rhonda Moore, our teacher of the year. I just can't say enough 
about what they mean to our students. And that's what it really is all about. This is all about ensuring that our students are poised to be the best that they can possibly be as they grow and to give back to our community. So whether they go to college or whether they go to work, whatever it is that they choose to do, we just would like to ensure that they are prepared. We don't always know what the next century is going to look like, but we know we have to build students who are problem solvers, who are critical thinkers, who can work together. And that's what our work is. And Rhonda Moore and our new teachers are exemplifying that. And we just thank them for their support and for their hard, hard work. We've got so many wonderful sponsors here today, and we've got such goodies, and, and we just are grateful. So I'm not going to keep going. I could go on and on and on, but I'd just like to recognize all of the, our community for your support, and thank you for that. Okay, so at this time, I would like to have uh, Senator Steve Hershey. Why don't you come on up and do the first one for us, please? Thank you. Well, thank you all very much. I'll just very quickly say we have a citation to provide you, but it is one of the highest honors that we have. Um, members of the 36th district, we have four different counties within our district, um, and we get to present this four different times at four very deserving teachers of the year. So um, I have an official citation from the Maryland General Assembly that just simply says, be it hereby known to all that sincerest congratulations are offered to Rhonda Moore in recognition of her being named the Queen Anne's County 2018 Teacher of the Year. And I just want to add another thing, as I said, from a statewide basis, this is one of the most important uh, recognitions that we make from a General Assembly perspective. You will get to come to Annapolis for a full day and be recognized in each of the chambers and, um, and again, it's one of the great uh, opportunities and privileges that we have, so congratulations. Okay, at this time, can I have Delegate Steve Arms and Jay Jacobs, please? Pat Sajak has Vanna White. I have Delegate Jay Jacobs to help me here. Um, Vanna's much better look. Um, Congratulations. Uh, I am the resident delegate for Queen Anne's County in our district, and I've had the pleasure of both my kids attending our schools. One is still there. We're hoping he gets out in the next two. So. Um, and he will do fine. But my daughter is a product, and she is something that you all should be proud of. She's taken advantage of what, all, what you all do very well. Going into the University of Maryland with 30 cre credits that were accepted into the Honors College is really not only a tribute to her, it's a tribute to your system. And Queen has kind of done a remarkable job. And I think, Dr. Kane, appreciate all the things you've been doing, all the time you've given me face to face. But most important, I will tell you this, a good senator mentioned it, you do get to come over to Annapolis, and we will get to it. I can assure you, the applause in the House of Delegates will be infinitely louder <laughs> and better, and you will be more appreciated than you know. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> all right, Vanna, thank you. Um, <laughs> we, <laughs> we do have a citation, um, and, and this is, I, I think the Senator put it right, this is really the most important part of our job is to give back like this. And we can't tell you how much we appreciate what you do for our kids. And when you have them in the system, you see the, what you've been able to produce, we appreciate it. I'm sure the kids love you, and if they love you half as much as the others, you'll be more on with them forever. So I have it from the Maryland General Assembly, an official citation, be hereby known to all that sincerest congratulations are offered to Ron Moore in recognition of being named Queen Anne's County Public Schools 2018 Teacher of the Year. Delegate Steve Aaron, Delegate Jay Jacobson, and Delegate Jeff Price sends his regrets, but he's attending another meeting. So, congratulations. We look to see you. Look to see you. I used to do this for the chamber. I could, if you want to sit on. <laughs> You're crazy cute. Okay, and right now I would also like to bring um, our commissioners, Jack Wilson and Jim Moran. Can you two please step forward? Thank you. Real quick, I just wanted to say, uh, uh, as a commissioner for three years, um, kind of echo uh, Dr. Kane's comments. One thing I've found in this community more than any other where I've lived in my life or even traveled to, and I've traveled to 49 out of 50 states, is the amount of charity 
and, and how we pick each other up, uh, whether it's a tornado or just a bad day at work or cleaning up communities or helping our kids or helping our teachers of the year. Um, it's, it's a tremendous, proud moment for me to be a commissioner in this county, especially when I go around the rest of the state and get to say I'm from Queen Anne's County and talk about the things we do. And the way people open their eyes when I tell them some of the stuff that we do here just from a philanthropic standpoint and how we're dealing with the opioid crisis. It's amazing that other counties aren't doing that. And it's the same with our school system. I give our school system all the credit in the world. They do a lot with less than others, but they get it done. And it's, it's a matter of the community support that really brings it to another level that you don't see elsewhere in the state. We know other counties and cities, they get a lot more money for their kids, but they do a lot less with it. And I congratulate Dr. Payne, all of our teachers, and especially our Teacher of the Year, Rhonda, and I have a proclamation to read for you. And you can come to Centerville if you want, but we usually only have three people at the commissioner's meeting, so I don't know that you're going to get a big round of applause. Okay. You can bring some more teachers with you. Okay, proclamation 1855. Whereas Rhonda Moore, a first grade teacher for 10 years, currently teaching at Mattapique Elementary, was named Queen Anne's County Public School Teacher of the Year. And whereas Rhonda Moore was nominated by parents, students, community members, supervisors, and other Queen Anne's County public school employees, and whereas Rhonda Moore will be honored at the annual awards gala, an event that allows Queen Anne's County Public Schools to put a spotlight on their outstanding employees, and whereas Queen Anne's County Public Schools Local Teacher of the Year program is affiliated with the Maryland and National Teacher of the Year program. Now therefore, we the County Commissioners of Queen Anne's County congratulate Rhonda Moore for going above and beyond every day to positively influence and change the lives of students in Queen Anne's County. Signed your Queen Anne's County Commissioners. touch on one thing you know I'm going to steal a line from Linda Friday who's the president of the chamber and she says that the chamber is a dot connector and all we do is we connect dots we connect the business community to our education community and I always think and I have always believed this that it takes three C's to help support our education community it takes the chamber it takes our commissioners and it takes the community. And as you can see tonight, you have a lot of support, a lot of support. That's how much we think of you. So, okay. We would like to thank uh, the, the county commissioners for their continued support of the Teacher of the Year and the business community. And at this time, we would like to present Rhonda with her gifts and say a few words. So are you ready? I think so. Okay. I'm not really used to talking to people unless they're sitting crisscross taco sauce on the floor, but I'll, I'll do my best. Um, you know, there's moments like these that, that words like thank you and, and gratitude just don't seem big enough. Um, this summer I got a letter from Jeff Strait saying that the chamber wanted to put together a little gift basket for me. And I'm like, that is just the sweetest thing. And they wanted to know my hobbies and my interests and what I need for my concert. I'm like, that is just so cute. And I wrote that I like to scrapbook and I'm an empty nester and I don't cook very much, much to my husband's chagrin and I don't garden, but you know, I like to read and you know, my kids need a few balls and some markers and oh, gosh, thanks so much. And then I got an email back the next day that said, here's the budget. I think you need to think bigger. <laughs> and I did not sleep for two days, and I'm not exaggerating. It was, I was so incredibly overwhelmed, and I must have shown that email to 20 people to make sure that I read it correctly. <laughs> and, and I'm a pretty good reader, but it was seriously just the most overwhelming. I felt like I had won the lottery. Um, I spoke at the gala about how moving here from a small town in Pennsylvania and not knowing a soul and being accepted into this community as, as family. And honestly, until I became Teacher of the Year, I'm not sure I really knew what that meant, what the position meant, and, and really maybe even what it meant to be a part of this community. And I just, I feel like my family just got a lot bigger and it's, I'm just so grateful. Um, you know, it, it's kind of a cliche, the old, it takes a village, you know, to raise a child, but it, it's the truth. You know, it takes loving parents and supportive friends and family and teachers who are willing to give from their hearts and commit their lives to making someone else's life better. And that is what all the teachers of Queen Anne's County do. So the fact that you are allowing me to represent them is such, is such an honor. And 
it takes a community like this um, that makes everyone's job easier and I just don't even know what to say. It's amazing. I cannot wait to take this back and make my classroom an even better place for kids. Um, you know, part of what's going back to Mattapique is flexible seating for my kids so they can feel more welcome and more comfortable in my classroom and um, ink for my color printer, which I, is just astronomical. And now they can have color learning centers and, you know, it's just so much more engaging. And I just could not be more grateful. And I thank you from the bottom of my heart and you will always have a friend at Mattapique Elementary. Thank you. Okay, well, at this time, let's give her one more round of applause. Wonderful job. Well deserved. Well deserved. Okay, everybody, well, we have plenty of food left, and obviously we still have an open bar, so now that everybody has done their, um, their speeches and what have you, if I could have the officials here, because we would like to have a photo op, and Dr. King, please, and everybody else, eat, drink, and be merry. Go out and do good business, and go out and be great teachers. Thank you. Yes, what is your principal's name? Miss Shrekking Gosh. Miss Shrekking Gosh, where are you? Come on, front and center. Nice. <laughs> <laughs>